Good morning. Happy Tuesday, everybody. Dr. Steven Zom here for this week's episode of Tooth Teacher Tuesday. Thank you for tuning in, and we'll jump right into today, to today's topic, which is kind of picking up where I left off many, many weeks back. Um, we talked a bit about root canals and kind of the basics, what, what they are, what that means, what the process is. And so I promised some more episodes in the future discussing, you know, various offshoots of that topic. So today I want to talk about a question I get asked fairly often, which is, okay, so my tooth is infected, it needs a root canal. Once the root canal is done, is that root canal going to last forever? Do I have to worry about that root canal in the future? And you know, basically the, the honest but non-committal answer is that hopefully not, but like any dental work, whether it's fillings, crowns, root canals, implants, you know, we would love for everything we do to last forever, but you know, with various different factors at play, there's a chance that that root canal can go bad. And you know, various other things can happen to that tooth as well. So do root canals last forever? Sometimes they do. Um, in fact, many times they do. But when they go bad, it's usually for one of a few reasons. One is, and again, this is true for any dental work, if your oral hygiene isn't great, then that's going to allow that root canal to become reinfected, whether it be from a new cavity or from the seal that was established by that root canal going bad and leaking bacteria into the tooth again. That's one reason a root canal can go bad. And another reason is that, as we previously discussed, root canal teeth, once the root canal is completed, it may have saved the tooth, but it's also going to make that tooth much more fragile, uh, which is why after a root canal, a lot of times we'll recommend a crown. Uh, there's certain situations where we wouldn't recommend a crown after a root canal, but oftentimes we do. And that is to protect that tooth from being fragile. And so if, if a root canal is done, but a patient declines to do a crown for whatever reason it may be, there's a chance that that tooth could end up breaking because it's fragile. So that, that's another reason that a root canal tooth can go bad. Um, and then I would say probably the other main reason we see root canal teeth go bad is that the tooth was already too far gone before we did the root canal. And what I mean by that is, I said this before, but root canal, teeth that get root, neck, root canals, you know, they're infected, the nerve is dead or dying, that tooth's on its last leg. And so the root canal's a last ditch effort to try and save that tooth. And sometimes we can successful, successfully save that tooth for the rest of a patient's life. But other times, if that tooth is too far gone, then eventually, whether it be sooner or later, that tooth will go bad and again, either become reinfected or start to crumble or, you know, the root canal may not even take hold in the first place. So if all these factors are in our favor, a lot of times root canals will last your whole life. But if any of that is working against us, then typically no, a root canal won't last forever and will either need to be redone or if redoing the root canal isn't an option at that point, then at that point we recommend removing the tooth. That's kind of if the tooth's beyond the point of redoing a root canal, our hands are tied and really the only recommendable treatment is to remove that tooth. So hope this gives you kind of an idea, sets a reasonable, reasonable expectation for what to expect from your root canal tooth. 
Uh, if you have any more questions about this, you know, feel free to tune in. I plan on doing some more episodes about root canals in the future, or feel free to reach out to me as well with, with your specific questions. So I thank you for tuning in. I thank you for your time, and I would appreciate you tuning in next week to Tooth Teacher Tuesday. Thanks, and have a great week.